Hey guys, it's Jim Rose with uh, RPM Dynamics and Midas 101. Today we're going to show you a little trick on the Midas. Um, this usually comes up when I go to a show and I see somebody operating on Midas and it'll be something that they don't expect to ask me, but they'll click into their automation page and all of a sudden they'll be like, hey, do you know how we can get rid of all these empty scenes? And they'll be looking at the console and trying to figure out how to get rid of empty scenes that pop up between things. So say we're on, uh, we're on a... Uh, uh, right now scene 14 we'll call it that we're in here and I hit store and I go insert before scene and it allows me to put something onto a scene 13. But if we go back to this scene 14 and now we click on store scene again and we go insert before scene it bangs 10 extra scenes into this thing so now we've got all of these extra scenes that are in the show that we really don't need and a bunch of you have probably said, we'll just click on it, and you right click and you hit delete, and you expect to do, do something, and it really doesn't. They are all still there. Well, there's a pretty easy way to get rid of these things. Click on one of the scenes that's active, it's an actual scene. Scroll up to the eyeball that's right under the add MIDI in the taskbar across here. Click on the eyeball, and it'll give you an option list for show options. Once you get into that show options, click on the box that says empty scenes, hit OK. And here you go. All of the scenes that aren't in use and all of the scenes that you haven't stored something in will be gone from your view options. They still exist in the, in the, in the file, but it's not going to show you anything that's not active. So you can get your, uh, your automation page back into making sense for you. Little trick, hopefully it's something you can use. Jim Rose, RPM Dynamics, Midas 101.